Famous for the Long Island iced tea. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's what they're famous for. So. <laughs> <laughs> But uh, Doc Lobster, a monster, super secret hidden boss, uh, doesn't get to travel very much. Um, yeah, so we're going to see how they do. So... Doc Lobster kind of thriving in between two foxes currently. Like, this is a lot smoother than it, I would, I would, appear, it would appear here. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Uh, unfortunate ST from Drat, I think, uh, got a little too caught up in yeah. Doc Lobster's edge guards. But, and here we see the value of Double Fox in that it is just so hard to kill them. It it's, is so hard to kill them. You have them in between you and they both just shine out of shield and you're like, okay. okay you oh, I, I know I say that and immediately two Fox death. I get it. I know how it looks, but I promise it is. It's really just two sides of the same coin. You have to believe me. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And it looks like green team, they're going to focus. Gosh, I feel like there's a bit of a disparity there. They didn't know what they wanted to do. Doc for the Foxes? Yeah, yeah. Like they didn't know whether the edge guard or team up on the team up on Brad, so. Rich was talking about how he doesn't actually like double Fox in Norway because the Fox will just do the exact same thing that he's doing. Very and, European. And yeah, so now he might be he <laughs> might, yeah, very European. He might be struggling because like, Andy's just doing like a couple other cool things. things. Yeah, yeah, other things. Exactly. He's like, oh, I, I thought you were going to back here too. Oh, uh, and there's a double fox recovery getting burned using that as support. Uh, I'll say that I am also seeing a lot of good team strategy from, from Brad and Dr. Lobster. Brad clearly has goals with these lasers, either saving Dr. Lobster or supporting he's uh, Dr. Lobster. And he's had, he's got a bit of trouble with the saving lasers, but that's only because it's so difficult to get two foxes off of you. Yeah, and thread the needle between two foxes, right? Like, like it's so easy for them to tank the laser. Yeah, you'll only get like two lasers coming down, and you'll need you'll need your teammate to get hit by one. Yeah, yeah, for sure. I've definitely seen people like aggressively jump into the Falco laser just to ruin it. Alrighty, and let's see. Both foxes in the corner is rough. I've seen that a lot. This Doc, game. Doc Lob again sliding to the ledge for his edge guard, like butter. Alright. Which uh which one has the melee set? This tag? is rich. It looks okay. This, I think this is rich. I don't know. Wait, do the other fox have a tag? No. Ambi's kinda got game no, 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 I think it's Ambi then. Yeah, I think yeah, it's Ambi. I, I think it's Ambi. Uh, hard to tell. Ambi, of course, uh, part of melee stats. Yeah, Ambi has a very piercing gaze when he's looking at the screen. Yeah, uh, and the head, uh, head nod confirms it for me. And that's going to be really tough. Yep, there it is. Um, yeah, I think Dr. Lobster is really the main force that Rich and Ambi have to figure out uh, this. Yeah, this any, any time they got near ledge, he would... He was almost like a puff, just really just always edge guarder. Yeah. Always hitting the bear. Plus, uh, I think uh, Rich and Amy kind of getting cornered a lot. And when both foxes are cornered, it can be hard for the other team. But I, I mean, you know, you're not in center. It's very easy for one mistake to, to push you off edge and put yeah. you in the quick edge guard. Yeah, it's very easy for like Falco to just read your roll away. Like she can uh -huh. just sit there and pressure you. So they go to Yoshi's, less space. Um, I think that's fine. Uh, it should be easier for both foxes to support each other. But you are closer to the ledge. You're, you're closer to being you're, you're, you're edge guarded You're closer to Dr. Lobster. <laughs> yeah, that's that's a really big issue, to be honest. Uh, great bullying on Brad, Doc, but... Doc okay, Lobster's not everywhere. Quite gonna, oh. Not quite going to die for it. And it feels like Dr. Lobster's everywhere because there's so... Little space. They're, they're, and they're watching their teammate. They're watching Brad, and they know the points that they have yeah. to go to. Yeah, Brad slid off the ledge, fell for a second. Dr. Lobster immediately was like, this is my edge guard to take now. Yeah, exactly, exactly. I, I think that there has been a lot of great team strategy coming out of Blue Team. Rich's still a bit confused on like what he like has to do to offer Andy like assistance here. Yeah, yeah. Oh my Dr. Gosh. Lobster. Dr. Lobster is so prepared. That's Unfortunate SD off the chic poop. I will say, uh, this is very close. Brad is gonna live, but you know, one edge guard, one up smash. 
Yeah, see, with the, you see, you see Dr. Lobster made that mistake. It's like she cannot get good damage on low percent for Fox without down throwing. Uh -huh. It's immediately an opportunity for Fox to just up smash, wave shine, do anything else to she. Yeah, honestly, like the other Fox should be reacting to sh Oh my gosh. Pretty much every fair. time she should get up smash. Yeah. yeah. Unless they're busy being comboed yeah, by Yeah, if you're already being hit, there's you know? nothing there's And nothing that is going to factor into Dr. Lobster's decision making is, okay, look at my teammate. Look at what's possible. Am I able to down throw here? That's the degree difference. Yeah. Right yeah. There. I mean, I, I think blue team is really showing a lot of great teams play rather than focusing on a lot of great singles play, which they do have to be clear. And this is going to be really tough. Ambi with the 1v2 again. Uh, basically can't get hit. <laughs> yeah, and Ambi gets hit, so that's going to do it. That's a little silly end to that 2-0. Uh, and so that was our two seed versus three seed. And we'll see, so we'll see Dr. Pool, Lobster so. and Brad in top 32 winners of Shine Doubles. Very cool, very cool. Love to see it. Hope they can make it far. Uh, mm -hmm. Love to see the Northeast And teams. they'll be playing J-Flex and Mech in the first round of that bracket. Cool. Mm -mm -mm. Alrighty, so we'll see if we're gonna mm -hmm. get another match. I mean, next we're probably getting like I don't know Dawson Majerus, Drew and G Pig. I thought is that not an A two A three? That's an A three. That's a, yeah. It's a two, I think three, I think we're probably getting A one A four stuff. We'll see. Maybe we get a. I don't know that there is much A A one A four stuff. Yeah, we have not get. we have not gotten No Flux Eggy versus Twisty Silver. I really hope that happens for us. Yeah.